These probably look insane. I'm just gonna do the intro blind because I know my lighting doesn't work well with my blindness. And I don't feel like I, I'm right here, guys. I wear contacts. Um, I, I don't feel like putting them in. I also don't feel like walking through, walking through the door. I don't feel like walking through the door. It's a bad ripoff. Go watch Max Mofo if you want some door stuff. I'll put door in. Imagine I'm, I'm less tired than last video. So I'm going to be more awake, but I'm sick. So I'm going to be coughing and sniffling because I'm annoying. But I, I bought this for $12 before I started doing the don't spend any money challenge. I spent money. And now this has just been sitting on my floor and I got a job. I got a job. Oh my God, there's dust dust particles flying around and that's all I can see because I'm, I'm so nearsighted. That's the only thing in focus. Anyway, I work at a place that sells Pokemon booster packs. I work at a video game place. Um, so I wanna buy more cards, but I can't justify buying more cards because I didn't see what's inside of these. Ooh, also I bought a promo pack. Where? What is this? Here's the weird, uh, didn't even come with a code or anything because it just came with three cards. It was a, literally a promo pack. Here's, here's my proof, but I don't have the card with me. It's with my boyfriend because he has a binder of our good, good old cards um, at his house. But I um, found a Hyper Rare, I found a Blasephion, however you say that's an Ultra Beast, in a Dollar Tree pack. So it was a dollar, I got three cards, and that was one of them, and it's worth like $30 online, so. Pretty good, this guy's. I also, I showed you guys Tapu Bulu last time that I, that I found. That was another Hyper Rare, Hyper Rare, just from a booster pack. Um, just a loose. Boy, let's open these so I can buy more and then open those because I have a problem. What's up guys? Welcome back to my dope ass setup. This is also where I do my makeup. So I have some stuff that um, I, I put on my face. I don't know where that other eyelash went. Um, I, I, I drop your prescriptions in the, in the comments. Um, negative five in one eye and negative four in the other. I forgot I own this. I used my roommate's screwdriver to put um, new batteries in it, but when I tried to turn it on, it just didn't do anything. This came out like third gen, I believe. It's supposed to be a Pokedex. I think it used to do cool stuff, but uh, mine seems to be permanently dead, so call me, beat me if you would like to reach me. Did I tell y'all? I put my trainer code, I mean, I put my trainer code in the last video, but I, oh my god, I'm, I'm trash at throwing the balls. My friend Nick tells me to grow up and throw curveballs. Um, I don't. But I put my, oh wow, I'm surprised I got that. I put, oh, I totally should use the pineapple berry. Should got them double candies. Um, <laughs> good. I put my trainer code on Twitter, and then I, I have like 65 friends now because I got a bazillion friend requests from people like around the world, and I think that's really cool. Like, I, I ain't even, I'm not gonna get that. I ain't even, well, no, that's not it. Um, I ain't even fronting. 65 friends, guys, Wathrin. Here I am. But I'm a lame ass, and I don't have any of the final evolutions of the starters. I'm literally five, six, six candies away from a, a Blastoise. But I just, a hundred candies just seemed really, really daunting when I first started. So I just didn't even try and I kind of gave up. And obviously it's dead where I am, but except for that centret. I mean, what if I click on it and it's shiny? Oh, I should show you. I have, I have a shiny, some shiny boys. Um, I found a shiny ratata. Rat rat I say ratatat, but that's, that's a band, ratatat. It says ratata. I, I, I. I don't know. It's clearly spelled ratata. Rat, rat tata. I say ratatat. Um, but I caught, I caught a shi shiny strong boy. Look at him. Look at his arms. I want to make a video eventually on how, uh, the humanoid kind of Pokemon, pretty creepy. Like that. Like, I don't know. You can have a female Machamp and like. Titties out, like, just, 
I mean, I'm just confused by how that works, but I get it. They're not, they're mythical beings, but like, I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is a female Machop and it's like, I mean, it looks like it has gills. It looks like it should be like a water Pokemon. Like, are those gills or those tiny abs? Just titty is out, guys. <laughs> like, who is this guy? Give him the old razzle dazzle. Anyway, that's all I want to show you on my phone in there. But we haven't gotten to the box yet, guys. I got myself a 3DS. And I put stickers on it from. Oh my gosh. From my Stick It X, dude. I got this in like 2009. I used all the good ones, but um. I mean, no tea, no shade to these, these legendary boys. These legendary fellas. Jirachi's pretty cool. They just, they just have this lame kind of pose. I don't know, Jirachi's just sleeping. I guess that's mostly what Jirachi does. And I specifically put them on this way, so when I'm gaming, folks, folks know what I'm about. I wanted to put them facing me, but, you know, can't, can't be all about me. Um, Croissant and Jirachi. Um, Pikachu and Pikachu. I love, love that. Um, but, oh my gosh, I started playing... Um, Pokemon X. I'm catching up. I literally just started. I picked Fennekin. Like, I didn't do anything in the game except for catch, like, the Pokemon that you can first catch, like Pidgey and stuff, which I was shook by, guys. I was shook that they have so many Pokemon from all the generations in these games. I should have done all this talking while it was still on me, but I was blind. Oh, well. Now you're just seeing my hands move. Um, <coughs> oh my god. Um, but yeah, I'm catching up on the games. I... As I said, I work at a video game store, so I got this boy. Got this at a little little discount. I got Ultra Moon on an impulse, um, but I have the other games in here. I got Sun specifically um, because Alolan Vulpix is in Sun. And Sand Shrew, Alolan Sand Shrew is in Moon. And then I was like, I gotta switch it up for the Ultra, so I'll get Ultra Moon. I don't know if that's stupid to... Because I know it's a continuation, like, should I be continuing, continuing Sun if I got Sun? Who, who fucking, who cares? Um, mix it up, spice up your life. So I started X, doing the thing, um, and also while we're, while we're at it, freaking check out my old DS. Have I shown you guys this? Look how crusty dusty, it's got a broken hinge. Um, I had Pokemon stickers on it. I think I had like a shell house over here, but I, I've had this Mew that stayed with me from the Stick X from 2009. I colored this with colored Sharpie. I colored in these. Um, it's just scuffed. You can see, I don't know if, yeah. You can see the circular marks are from Pokemon Ranger. Um, is this my Kirby game? Yeah, my, my fucked up Kirby game. Got stuck in under a, a seat in my mom's minivan. Still works. It's in the shape of a heart. It's pretty cute. Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland is the shit. There's a home video of me getting this for Christmas and losing my mind. Just going ape shit. I was like, oh my god. Um, don't have the stylus. My sister would chew on the styluses and they would fall out and I'd have to buy new ones. What the heck's in here? Pokemon Black, which I literally have barely gotten through. Like, I, I haven't played Pokemon Black. I just jumped right into X because Black is just, I know, like, Black and White, 5th Gen, people, people skipped 5th Gen. Like, someone at my work said they skipped 5th Gen. My boyfriend skipped 5th Gen. Like, it, it was just a crusty, dusty, old, like, none of the, none of the starters, like, there's just really no, there's no flavor to this. Like... I pick Snivy. I never go with grass. I was like, uh, I never go with grass except for Turtwig. Turtwig is beautiful. I love Turtwig. But it was just crusty, dusty, musty. Fifth gen sucks. So sorry, fifth gen, if there's any cutie patoots in there. I'm really coming for your neck right now. Kanye ugly. But anyway, let's get into this little discount box. I can't even, didn't even get it in the frame. Oh my gosh, here, I'll just, I'll just pan up on ya. Da -da -da. Includes one big ass card <laughs> and the smaller version of it. And maybe some rare boys in the, uh, in the packs. I see we have a Sun and Moon, we have a Fates Collide. I think we have, yeah, we have two Fates Collides and an Evolutions, which is fun. Evolutions is where the, where the good Charizard is. Um, so let me rip this. Let me yeet this open. The Charizard 
EX. Oh, I don't want to cover up Vulpix. Whatever, I'll just put it here for the time being. I'll, I'll reorganize. Probably should have should put those in sleeves. Even though they come in these boxes, so I'm sure they're not worth a ton. They could be. Um, and if you want the code card, I'm literally just giving shit away on my channel. Because, uh, what up to my 17 subscribers? If you guys play online. <laughs> Any passer buyers. Literally free stuff. Because I don't, I don't play online, so this doesn't, like... Like, my $12 bought this, but, like, I'm not going to use it, so. So, to someone that will use it, you know? We're just, like, recycling it. Ooh, that reminds me. Yesterday at Taco Bell, they made a mistake, but it, like, worked in my favor, usually. Because I'm vegan. Um, I will get Taco Bell, and they'll, like, accidentally... Whoa. Um, accidentally put meat in my order, cheese or something, and then, like, obviously I can't eat that. Um... But they gave me someone else's order and my order, and my order was right. So I got my food, and then I got someone else's meaty, cheesy stuff that I couldn't eat, but I was like, oh, dope. Like, I paid $9 for, like, way more food, so I just gave it to my roommate. But I forget why I just told that. Getting free stuff. Oh, the code cards, right? Right. Obviously. So goofy. These big cards. Just so silly. I can reorganize later. Um, I'll just... <laughs> just put it with the uh, Lincoln Rock. I'll just cover him up. But yeah, pretty pretty cool. Still don't know. Still still pretty mixed about the big cards. I think I like them. I think they're cool. But when you spin them around and see that it's just a giant card, it's just a little bit silly. I thought these were the same thing when they were in there because I just saw the X and Y, but Primal Clash and Fates Collide, Sun and Moon, and Evolutions. Neat. I kind of want to start with Evolutions because I'm excited. I like the little throwbacky cards. Oh boy, um, what is the thing for this? I feel like it's like flip it over, show you the code card. I feel like you throw off the energy at the back for evolution, little evolutions. Um, and then you do three to the front. Okay. Double colorless energy. Um, Super Potion. I'm like struggling to read for you. I'm so sorry. We got Charmeleon. Caterpie. Ooh! I think I see the Reverse Hollow. My bad. Um, Ghastly. Um, Diglett. Rotata, as we were talking about. Oh, I did do it wrong. Oh, no, I didn't. Ooh, look at these. Oh, boy. That is nice. I, I like that. Okay. Raichu and Polyrath. Cool. So not anything like crazy, but at least a, a a real hollow. We love that. Oh, that's cool. Cause like I don't remember like where like I don't know. This pack's very nostalgic, obviously, cause it's like the throwback art. But, geez, Louise, I just I don't remember pulling hollows as a kid, cause like I don't I don't even remember being a kid, dude. Da da da. da, da. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Oh man. Oh technique. Uh, Professor, that guy, Corsola, Repel, Drowsy, Rowlet, super cute, um, Torkoal, I'm, I'm reading this like I don't know these Pokemon, Zubat, Grubbin, it's just been a while since I've been reading, guys, I don't, ooh, oh my god, something's good back there, oh my god, oh, Picky Peck, ooh, who is this bitch? Oh, I did do it wrong. There was an energy at the end. But who whomsta? That looks that's a full art. That's not like a hyper rare, but like that's that's good. Ooh. Lorantis. I literally who do you evolve from? Formantis. I don't even know this this Pokemon yet. Getting learnt. I'm getting there. But we've had good luck so far, dude. I knew, see, I knew this box was just sitting there, and I'm like, I know it's got good shit in it. I know I gotta open it. I'm just gonna stare at this for a little bit. Cool. Cool beans. This is probably worth something. I don't know. I like it. Neat. We love that. I totally saw something good. Oh, shit. It could have just been the reverse hollow. Oh, I'm getting too excited. Oh, man. I'm opening these like a bozo. Um, you can just give them water instead of potions? Like, okay, word. Water really does cure everything. Twitter was right. Nidoqueen. I almost have one of these in Pokemon Go, but I forget how many. I think I need like five candies. Somebody tr trade me one so I can harvest it for one candy. It's not going to even be worth it. Seedra. Bidoof. Star Starfish Man. Volbeat. Nozzin Pass. Dude, 
evolve for him. Terrifying. Electric chair. Don't like him. Um, oh my god, I'm exposing myself. Spinda. Sceptile. There was an event for Pokemon Go today where you can evolve a Sceptile and he would have some special move that I forget. Um, uh. Ooh, a full art trainer. Oh my gosh. I'm literally getting good cards and I'm just like casually reacting to it. That's some good shit, right? That's probably some good shit. I love that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like, wow. That's pretty freaking cool. 157 and 160. Damn, girl. Okay. Okay. These packs. These $12. Walmart, dude. I'm, I'm going to look up the values of these. Maybe I'll like edit it in because like, shit, I feel like I got my money's worth. Also, I got a big ass Charizard card. So like, I definitely got my money's worth. Also, this brings me joy. So it was worth it. So let, let us see. Uh. There's Snivy. Sorry. Did you hear me talking shit? Snivy looks pissed as shit that I was talking shit about a uh, what was I talking shit about? <laughs> oh, 5th gen. 5th gen's just bad, guys. Sorry. It's just bad. It's bad. Makes me sad. That is the tea. Sister. Let us see. I like Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan's like one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, I, it's, I was looking up all the Mega Evolutions. I'll do a video giving my opinion on the Mega Evolutions because the internet asked for that. No. The internet didn't ask for that, but they need it. And I'm going to give it to them. <laughs> it's cool that the little dude jumps out, but that's... Eh, you know what? I kind of like that as a mega evolution. I think, you know, he deserves his time in the... in the. What am I talking about? In the spotlight. Um, I don't even know what gen this is from. Is this fifth gen that I that I diss? Sin... Sin... No? Cinnamon buns? Shockle. We love Shockle. I do. There's that Snivy that hates me. Carbink. I had a Carbink break car last time. Larvitar. Diglett. Spoink. If they stop jumping, they die, and that makes me upset. Um, this cute energy. It's pretty cute. Um, on a regular old card for, uh, like, of course, our last pack is just like, oh, it's just a regular old rum pig, but you know what? We had some good luck. It's kind of, it's cool art. Well, this guy's cute. So, that's a cool energy. Cool reverse dude. Yeah, so that's all the packs, man. Doesn't it make you just want to buy more packs? Actually, I bought um, one other pack while I was at Walmart when I bought this. Just be so I could have something to open at the end. Just because I have a problem and I like to open shit. Um, I don't know, I just thought it'd be funny to open a little pack at the end. Um, but I opened it... This past weekend, yeah, and I got a um, Ho-Oh EX card, which I sent back with my boyfriend to put in um, our binder thingy. So, I don't have that, but I opened it. I forget which even pack it was, I forget. Yeah, I forget which series, but, but now my battery is dying just as I finished. So, thank you for watching, and I'm going to buy more cards at work and do this again. Peace.